Ops. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Black Ops 3. Uh, just real quick, since I did a pretty crappy job of explaining it last time. Nick is the top screen, I am the bottom screen. Nick's Xbox sucks at streaming. <laughs> um, for the best experience in the... the in any way possible, really, is to not watch this in full screen. Um, I can only edit the resolution so much before it's over edited, and then it just looks worse than it did before. And my only solution to the problem is don't watch it in full screen. Because, like, the resolution gets all dicky, and it's just, it's not a good time for anyone, and I can't fix it. <laughs> um,. Uh, what, where were they going with that? I don't even know. Just don't watch it in full screen and you should be fine. Um, but the, oh, this episode is funny moments, if you haven't already noticed, and, uh, glitches. Weird, don't make any sense glitches. Uh, Hardcore team more so in zombies. Match. Towards the end of the video, there's, uh, some zombie segments, especially the last segment. That one's funny as hell. And there are some dumb people out there on multiplayer. Like, there are some of the, there are really dumb people out there. Not to mention that Black Ops 3 is a pretty broken game, Ops, let's, let's be honest. If, if we're giving Call of Duty any credit for anything, it's not Black Ops 3. Because Black Ops 3 is probably the most broken Call of Duty game on the face of the planet. In regards to modern Call of Duty games. Uh, you join, you, you can join any multiplayer match and guaranteed you'll be matched up with some like 999 level scrub that just lives in his mom's basement all the time like that doesn't even have a job and he'll, he'll have like some like 12 flash drives plugged into his xbox and it'll just it'll not be a fun time and then zombies is broken in <sighs> in many humorous ways so we don't really complain about that one but Anyway, I just wanted a I wanted to make a commentary for a very funny, light-hearted video. Unlike the last one, I got kind of deep into life. Well, it was about about as deep as I'm willing to take it because I suck when it comes to anything that has to do with real feelings. And anyway, um, and as I was editing this, I realized that you know all the commentary I make is just kind of. I don't really want to say dark, it's just serious. It's very, it's very, um, full of, uh, what's the word? I don't even know. It's just non-lighthearted substance that can be hard on people. And I know 2017 has been a really shitty year for a lot of people. I know 2016 was just as shitty, and we were like, oh yeah, 2017 will be so much better, but it really, it's really not. We're about halfway through it now, and I mean, let's just, let's just be brutally honest, it's not better than 2016. 2016 could have been re-elected a whole nother year long term, and it, it would be, it would, it would still play out just the same as 2017 has, so... Uh, not to take, I don't want to take it to that direction, because this video is supposed to be funny. It's supposed to be great. I, th I find it funny. Nick Bank, Lula found it funny. Um, I hope you guys too. That's like, that's like the one thing I want. Like, coming out of this YouTube channel, I just want people to laugh. Just laugh. Even if it's dumb. Like, I know I suck at editing. There's a reason I don't, well, I didn't do it for the longest time. There's a reason I would upload a three hour long video and then wonder why I didn't get any views. Because I knew that. Well, because I, I, I don't even know where I was going with that. I just, I didn't care. And I just, I just wanted people to laugh at the stupidness. And. As this year has progressed, I've kind of realized that if I just put like, a little bit of editing into it, regardless of how shit I am at it, because let's be honest, I am very, very awful at editing thing. Like, very under par. And it doesn't help that where I go to school doesn't have any kind of class really relating to helping me with this. You know, it's just like. 
They don't have the, the like the most the closest class to this is a club that we have outside of school, and it's for film. And I already know how to film. I know how to edit film. I just don't know how to edit YouTube videos where it's something that people will want to watch. I mean, I well, that's not true. I know how to get it to be something people want to watch, but I don't know how to edit it like everybody else does. You know, it's it's very it's a very meticulous, tedious process that I just one don't have the patience to teach myself, or and two don't know how to do it, and I'm not willing to learn how to do it by myself. Um, but recently, recently I've just said, you know what, screw it. I'm gonna edit it. However, it turns out is how it's gonna turn out, and it will be fine. And that's exactly how most of these videos turned out. There's this weird ass black border around this video right now, and I don't know how to get rid of it. I don't know how to fix it. I don't know what I did wrong to where it showed up. Because it wasn't there when I was recording. There was no black border, and if I were to just straight up upload it from from the raw material that it was to YouTube, it would be a uh, there wouldn't be a black border, and I don't know how to fix it. But it's fine, you know. It's whatever. People are gonna complain. They're gonna complain. If people could care less like I do, they'll watch it anyway. And it is what it is. Um, but I've moral of the story is that I've, I've started editing my videos, and uh, a lot of good has has come from it. <coughs> I've realized that the videos that I have edited tend to get more views as opposed to the ones where I haven't bothered to edit. Now, it's also based on the game. Like, uh, I think I upgraded, or uh, uploaded StarCraft, and that one has, like, I don't even know. It, it has more views than most of the videos um, I've uploaded, but I didn't edit that one. So there will always be the videos that get a little bit more views just based on what game it is, or what the title is, or what it's about. But I've, real I've noticed that in general, the ones that I edit tend to get more views, and therefore they tend to be a little bit better off uh, for my channel. And, um, uh, and I've, I've really started to take it seriously, this whole not knowing how to edit thing. Um, I, I can use today as an example. I've been sitting in front of my computer for almost seven hours now, editing, just flat out editing videos. I edited Fallout 4, I've edited um, that, the, the first Black Ops episode, and now I'm on the second Black Ops episode. I've just non-stop edited today. Uh, I actually had to take a nap during editing this one. I just kind of let it play through one of the zombie videos because it was a long segment and I, really, I knew that I didn't have to edit most of that because I was just going to cut it out anyway because it was just the same old stuff, you know, shoot a zombie, end the round, start a round, shoot a zombie, buy something, end the round. And I knew I knew I didn't want that in the video because it wasn't very funny nor entertaining to watch. So, um, so I took a little nap for like maybe 12 minutes. Back to edit. Seven hours of edit. I know now why professional YouTubers complain about editing. And I know why they're not kicking out a video usually every single day, unless they've stockpiled it up for years. Like, uh, letting down the facts. Like, I don't even know, I can't even name any, but I know some of them do that, they just stockpile the videos, because editing the sucks. Um, it's not really something I truly enjoy, it can be entertaining, um, and, like, uh, what, the Splinter Cell Blacklist series that I've started doing, uh, that one was kind of fun to edit, just because uh, I didn't really talk a lot in it, and I think it gave me a lot of room to just edit whatever I wanted, and videos without dialogue tend to be a little bit more boring, so I figured I would just type in my own dialogue. I thought it was funny. I don't know about anybody else. It has like 10 views right now, so... Yeah, going strong, almost up there with the greats, for sure. <laughs> uh, but yeah, seven hours of editing, 
almost non-stop. Uh, well, I went to go get lunch and ate breakfast. And that's all I've really done today. Uh, I was going to go hang out with my friend Megan. We were going to make cookies and cake we don't just reward because she's failure. bored. RTP for um, debrief and reassessment. Going to work out with Trish later tonight. That should be fun. Um, and I don't know. I was thinking about maybe just having some me time and playing some Rainbow Six. Uh, I might rec I might stream that. I might record that. I might do both. Uh, come back to editing probably later tonight if I do that. Don't I don't even know. I might universe. just have some me time, listen to some music, and be bad at Rainbow Six Siege. But we'll see. Um, so we're at the point in the video where um, uh, the the zombie segment is about to start. Um, this is where <laughs> this is where most of the glitches and funny moments come from, um, and uh, I hope you I hope you all enjoy and appreciate the brokenness, the amount of broken that is put into this zombie. Map. It was it's just this map I think it's, it's not every map that's broken. It's just this one. Maybe try there's so much going on. The map is so big that I don't even know. If, even if they were patched, these maps, there's probably like hundreds more out there. Just because of how ridiculously large this map is. It's absolutely um, It's just, it's crazy. How it How Um, uh, so, I don't even know, this was, this was not where I was planning this video to go, but it turned into me talking about editing, what I'm doing with my day, very awkward to talk about, I don't know, but, um, yeah, seven hours, going on seven hours of editing, and I am exhausted, I will never, ever, ever, complain when a YouTuber, professional one, does not upload something of nice plan. in a couple days. Really I, I will never complain because I know what it's like now, now that I've started editing. But I, I enjoy it. It makes the videos more enjoyable. It makes you guys watch them. It exhausts me. <laughs> uh, but it's it's fun nonetheless. So uh, anyway, as we close this segment, um, I hope you guys enjoy this last glitch is probably the best one of them all. I hope you all have a fantastic day, have a great summer, and with that, I will see you all next time.